hey how's everyone doing in this video i'll be teaching you how to clear the unlocked bootloader logo on any uh, infinix techno devices so let me restart the phone so after restarting your device and the phone boost up you're going to see this message that says orange stitch your device uh, has been unlocked can't be trusted your device will reboot in five seconds so to do that kindly get lk.bin from the firmware from official firmware or backup file you back up it from the device and you install the software hxhd that's hex editor so you install the device and you load the lk.bin from the firmware folder so after loading it you're going to get something like this so what we are going to do after loading it is to click either control f which is find or uh, we just use the search bar at the top to search for a string we want to delete so string a string mean uh, a right line of uh, a phrase you want to erase so you just type the name of the string in the search box here and then you search for it so it's going to search through the binaries and then locate them for you so as you can see i just search for um i just search for these and then after pressing enter on the keyboard it's going to uh, give you the exact location for it so what you can what you do after searching for the string you were looking for just go ahead and replace um the binaries with zeros so i'm going to demonstrate to you guys uh in a few minutes so this um your, your device will reboot after five seconds so that's how you just you just have to look for the strings you want to delete so as you highlight this string on the right side the binaries will also highlight themselves that binary section so you just click on the first binary and then you keep pressing zero zeros on your keyboard they will be replacing the uh, string as you can see on the screen so i just replaced those so just highlight another string that you want to erase so this orange state your device has been unlocked and can be trusted 
so I just replaced the binaries with zeros um, so this of uh, this is a voiceover <clears throat> excuse me this is a voiceover I recorded the video when I was uh, at work so the, the voice might not go in line with what I'm doing on the screen so after replacing <clears throat> sorry excuse me after replacing the binaries you can just uh, save the new modified LK file so after saving it um, but, uh, so I missed I skipped a step there is another your device will reboot in five seconds which I forgot to replace in the LK file so after writing the LK file you see that I removed all the message that says your device has been unlocked and can be trusted your device will reboot in five sec so I forgot to remove the string so all the other ones will be, will be gone, but that um, your device will reboot in five seconds will be showing. So that's uh, well, you see it after the video. So now I'm trying to write the LK file back through CMD using um in fastboot using CMD. So what you actually do, you know, the device has, since you've already unlocked the bootloader, you'll be able to write uh, any file you want using uh, fast boot. So to do that, you can just make sure you have ADB files on your device and fast boot. So you can just reboot your device to fast boot manually or you use ADB reboot bootloader and the device will reboot to fast boot after the device is as rebooted to fast boot you can just use the code fast boot flash boot uh, fast boot flash lk and lk dot bin so the first lk locates the partition you want to write and the second lk dot bin is the name of the file so as you can see it gives me okay okay and then the next code I typed is fast boot reboot which means the device should reboot after writing the LK file so right now the device is booting and after the device uh, booted up I'm going to <coughs> excuse me I'm going to uh, start the device so that you see the message uh, the bootloader message that I just removed and <laughs> right here I'm, I was just trying to tell you that uh, in the LK file I missed a string I missed to remove a string so that's normal you can just do it over but I just left the single line the end of the video is just to show you guys how uh, to delete that message so, and we did justice to that all right so uh, this is after writing the LK file uh, let's see uh, the warning message so the device has booted up and you can see the message is gone just show you